Hey guys, Jeremy from That Guy's Secret. Um, it's kind of weird for me to be doing this type of video this time of year. Um, as it's the springtime and normally this would be an event that we're talking about in the fall. So due to everything going on, we got a lot of kids that are getting ready to go to homecoming uh, the next few weeks. So I thought it'd be a really cool idea to show you a couple different ways to tie your tie and you know, maybe uh, just learn how to tie a tie period. So. I'm going to show you two ways if I can here. Um, the first way, I mean, first thing you got to do is you got to pop your collar up, get it up there. The, the first knot is probably the, the easiest and the most simple knot you'll ever, you'll ever tie. You're going to have, this is my right hand, if, just to clear everything in the video. I always start with the shorter side here on the right. Um, this is the simplest knot. You just take it, hold it right, go over the big side over once, wrap it around to where you make a circle. Now you've looped it around completely there, and you're gonna go up and under through the rabbit hole there, right down the center, and you go like this. This is the by far the easiest knot. I think they refer to it as. square knot um, and then you slide it up here to your neck and boom uh, I personally don't use this knot all that often anymore as you notice it's a little off shape no matter what it's got a little bit of a, a, a weird shape to it so the knot I actually recommend is a, a Windsor knot and, the, and the, so the changes are gonna be this you're gonna notice I start off with a lot less on the right hand side so the tail really short still the right hand side Still flop over, first step is the same, over top, but we don't wrap around here. We go up and under right from the start, okay? Pull it back out. Now it's kind of laying to your right. You're gonna switch hands there, hold, hold that knot with your right hand. Go under now. Then you're gonna go on the outside through the hoop, okay? So now we've went through, the, we've went through this side and we went through this side. Now you're gonna reposition, hold the knot, and now you're gonna come around the front like this. Now is where you go around the whole thing, up and under, and down through the rabbit hole again here. So the reason why I like this knot is because it gets you an equal lateral triangle. It gets you a very well balanced knot because it, it, the way it's balanced. It takes more fabric, so that means you have a bigger knot. Um, I personally think this looks best on anybody, but as we get into a wider spread collar, it really fills up that gap. So all you gotta do is get it down there nice and tight, that then you pull it up here. And what you're trying to do is you're trying to get the tip of the tie to the button on your jeans. It's hard to see probably, I don't know if you can see all that, but to the top of your dress pants. Um,
Obviously I'm wearing jeans today because I'm casual and I just want to throw this on here for a quick video for you guys. But those are the things you're doing. Um, I'm taking a glance over there in the mirror to see how my knot looks. But you notice how it fills up this gap really well. It's perfectly balanced. It's not cocked off to one side. You'll see people and they're always fidgeting. So if you use this knot, the knot I recommend, um, and I'll slow it down in the steps to show you that um, in the video, hopefully. Uh, I may end up doing another video just on this exact knot. If you have any questions, if you need me to do it from a different angle where I'm watching myself in the mirror, feel free, but I thought it'd be easy. I always start with the shorter side on my right. I said, you gotta really start up here with the short piece, wrap it around depending on your height and all of that stuff, it all matters and it comes out looking really nice like that. So that's the tip of the day, how to tie a tie. Two different ways. Uh, as I said, the first one's a very simple square. You have to wrap it around there. And the second one takes a little bit more time, but I will tell you, you look so much better and you look very uh, put together with a better knot and you're not fidgeting with it all night. It'll just, it'll be a better situation for you. You can just enjoy your outfit and not have to worry about it and, and, and you'll look perfect. Let me know if you have questions, guys. Talk to you soon. Thanks again.